Hello everybody, so welcome back to another Bakugan unboxing video. Today I'll be unboxing the Heios Pegatrix Ultra with the Bakugan Heios Lightning Striker. This is from Armor Alliance Wave 1. So have a look at the front, have a look at the back. So what's included is one character card, one ability card and two Baku cards together with the uh, Bakugan and the Baku gear. Challenge level is 3. Wow. So have a look at the bottom in case you're interested. This is the sticker for the T Takara Tomi version. You can see that there's another uh, Baku at the bottom. Okay, so this is the Takara Tomi version. Same as the other videos, I'll do a comparison with the uh, Mimi World Korean version. Actually, there's not much difference, just that the, the color is red. Korean words. N number is 47. Yeah, so the back looks like this. It's basically the same. Not much difference other than the cuts. So this is the Korean version and this is the ta Takaratomi version, which is essentially the English version. Okay, so without further ado, let's open it up and have a look. Okay, we have our rulebook. Essentially the same instructions. Same as the ultra ultra version, 11 steps. I remember this had a lot of steps. Because of the, the legs, all the feet were manual. I remember quite clearly. So what character card do we get? Should be the same. Here's Pegatrix Ultra, double shield, 501. Yeah, it's the same. 501, same card, 226. Yeah, 226. The Baku Gear card, will be the same. So far, we have opened this. Only Dragonoid had the same Baku Gear card. The rest did not. So let's see whether it's the same. Hey, all braces. Six energy use plus one thousand and zero. See, yeah, it's the same card. Okay, so this and Dragonoid had the same card. Uh, Hydras and Trox did not. So we still have Nivius and Hellcore to, to check out. It's a bit strange to me that they will include different cards. I, originally, I thought all of them would be the same. Apparently, there's some difference. Makes me think whether it's a random card that's inserted. Anyway, let's take a look at it. Oh, it's earlier, it's 16th of December, 2019. The rest were 18th of December. Oh, the legs are already out. So you can see the manual parts are the four feet, the horn. Oh, the wings extend out a lot. So it's uh, seven, seven manual parts. So to roll it out, you need to close everything back up. Actually, once you got all the manual parts in, it's pretty easy to close. One, two, three, brah. It's meant to open on the cores anyway. You can have a look at the uh, video for the Ultra Single Pack. Uh, I used cores to open for that. Opening up all the manual parts. The legs, the feet, the horns and the wings. It looks like this. Yeah, so now let's try out Baku Gear. So this is apparently called the Lightning Striker. Chaos Lightning Striker. Okay, so this has the same style as the Dragonoid, which is um, horizontal, 90 degrees. Let's see. One, two, three. It's a bit heavy. It's a bit heavy for the impact, but you can you can support the weight. So Baku gear holes are right smack in the middle of the body here. In like that. And another one. Yeah. Really nice and cool. So after um, Armor Alliance, they never produced any more of this uh, mold of Pegatrix. They changed the mold. So I can't really compare to anything else. The only reason why the other Ventus and Hydras had because were, they were reproduced in uh, Legends in a different color. So this is Heios Pegatrix Ultra with the Bakugia Lightning Striker. So this has been my unboxing of Heios Pegatrix Ultra. We have these two cards, the character card and the uh, Bakugia card. Okay. So this has been my unboxing video for today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this content, please click the like button and subscribe to the next video. Thanks. Bye.